and welcome to the channel everyone this is king joshua if you're new here don't forget to subscribe thank you for clicking on this video today we're going to be playing expo vs mortal i will be the one using the mortal deck while i'll be playing against clash with moth it will be using the expo deck expo 2.9 while i'll be using i'll start with this model 3.3 the one with minor and raskers it's my favorite by the way but still i, I think i actually developed a new one um the link will be down in the description below you can check it out also for clash with moth channel you can check his channel out it's really really, really nice creator he does really good videos you can check him out the link will be down in the description below let's kick off until the first batch yeah okay um i want to start off with minor just just to be safe and i'm gonna try to play it safe i want to bait out his skeletons and that's the ice spirit because i know he's gonna want to deploy it okay okay advantage for me is that i know the deck is playing so i should try to be safe i'm gonna i'm gonna just be attacking with my minor that's um I'm gonna increase pressure with only minor, then defend with my mortar and my rascal. Hopefully that works out fine for me. Hopefully that works fine for us, rather. So okay. So a bit balanced here. First push was not that successful, but still okay. That's the expo. So mortar goes down defensive. That's a defensive mortar, by the way. Then minor behind the expo there because I don't want it. Okay. So that was a late deployment from my expo. So it's gonna get some decent hits onto my tower. Sure, surely we'll get those decent hits and okay. I think it's Irana for Elixir here because okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is an advantage for us because um he tried defending his ex but there, it didn't work out fine. The bats got some really decent value and hit onto his king onto his princess star there, so that's GG for us. I'm gonna increase pressure with my dad goblin. Okay. One shot from the dad goblin there, not not bad, not bad by the way, but um that's pretty awesome, pretty dope and slick. So Defensive Goblin Gang against three just for the um for the archers. I want to take her out on time so she doesn't get some damage onto my tower there. So that's why I threw the bad barrel by the way. Okay, minor gang goes down. Hopefully the goblin will get one shot. Nope, it went down. So it goes with defensive expo. Um honestly I want to increase pressure with my motor or try to balance things out with my motor. But if I deploy motor, it's gonna take at least three seconds before motor comes out and okay, that was a mistake. That was a huge mistake for me there. That was a mistake for me. I wanted to actually fireball the expo alongside with the tower on the right side. And that did not work out fine. Even my bats did not get to the expo. So hopefully I don't slack. So Barbara goes down. Also my Raskar is here. Nice positioning for my Raskar is there to avoid log. You guys notice that skill. <laughs> so Mora goes down also to defend in case my Rascal Girls goes down and the X will stay alive. But that was not necessary. Mana goes down again. Hopefully Rascal Girls will get one shot. And she probably get just two shots onto the King, onto the Princess Star there. Which is not bad. Not bad for an not bad for the Rascal Girl. Just one single one. So that, that's pretty balanced. Um that goblin goes down again to increase pressure. Okay, I'm splicing I'm I dropped bats by mistake. Honestly, that was supposed to be that was supposed to be Goblin Gang. So is that an advantage here? Hopefully, okay. Let's see, mana goes down alongside with my barbar. Just be safe, defensive. Defensive mortar goes down, and I'm gonna try to cycle my minor once once more, just so I can increase pressure onto his left lane here. And that goblin goes down for defense. Goblin gang onto the right side to increase pressure. Mana goes down again. I'm gonna try to see if. Okay, that goblin gets some decent shot onto the tower there. Alongside with my mana, I'm gonna throw fireball. Okay, no, no. To one fireball, I just have to cycle back to another fireball, and that would be GG for us. I'm going another Rascal down there, and I'm going with defensive mortar all. I just barbarate this and go with the mortar. And also, minor and fireball should end, end this year. Minor fireball should, should should finish this off. So, okay, minor would not get that shot, but fireball. Okay, the mortar even locked onto the tower, which was GG for us. So this is good game from us. First match here, we wrapped it up pretty easy, pretty quick. Um, GG2 clash with Moth by the way, it was in game. I actually, actually made tons of mistakes there, I think two or three mistakes and that would have cost me the match but still we're able to clutch and yeah, I get back to the win. So we're going up into the second match of this video. I'll be using the same deck though and it's going to be using the same deck so yeah. I should have switched up because now he also knows my play and if he knows my play it's going to be really tough for me to get that victory. <sighs> but let's see, let's see about it, let's see, let's see. We noticed in the first match, in the other match, he did not use his uh, Eden Tester, and that was surprising. I think he could have defended pretty well with the Eden Tester next to his Princess Star to catch the Miner and things like that. Okay, he went with Expo, and fortunately for me, my Dark Goblin survived. So he's gonna get those decent shot and Miner. Okay, 
Two shots from the dark goblin alongside with the miner. Locked onto his princess star. That that should be good good for us. That's really good for us. But I'm out of elixir now. Hopefully he doesn't go with expo. Yes, if he does, it's gonna be tough for me. And let's see, let's see. The motor the motor takes time before it's um it's it starts functioning, like I think 30 seconds after deploying. So it's really it's a really bad advantage for us because once you go expo before I realize and jump my motor, expo should have been in action and motors is gonna start counting before it's 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 really tiring like like what i just said now the x was already firing against my motor and before motor can lock onto the x is gonna take some decent time and by then the x must have taken out the motor so that that's the disadvantage there using this motor to defend against expo so i hope you guys got it so let's see bats no, no. So, so, so the miner died on time, and that that was the main reason why I could not go miner bats. And I just, I just want to try it out though. And that was my dad calling there. Hopefully, I'll call him back in a bit. I'll call him back in a bit. So, um, let's see, let's see. Motor at the center. Here. Defensive motor. He went with ice going to distract the motor. So, and not bad, not bad. Let's see if I can get some fireball value and also to the princess star that was that worked out fine worked out fine. i'm gonna increase pressure now with the miner and the dark goblin okay oh, that was a mistake for me i was hoping the, the uh, expo would lock on to the miner first okay he has under pressure so i'm gonna try to do this first then that okay he got my rascals there so the rascals girls are down Hopefully miner goes down on time and it got the miner one more time. So this is gonna be bad for us. It's probably gonna get us onto the tar. And okay. Okay, yeah, the goblin the goblins did a good job there. And bad bird goes down. Also, it's gonna he has another expo one more time. So I'm just gonna do this first. Hopefully I get my rascals on time. Rascals, rascals, come on, come on. So I'm just, I just wanna let that pass by. Okay, that's gone. So miner behind here just to be safe. It's not gonna predict it. Or can you predict it? Okay. So that, so that that was easy. Safe, we're safe, we're safe. So I'm gonna try to cycle to another miner. Let's see if I can increase the pressure onto the princess star. That if that is possible, then that's gonna be great for us. But defense first, defense first. So it, it just kept increasing the pressure with the expo, so I don't get the minor value, or so I don't get to deploy minor. But still, this is an opportunity for me. The um, oh, okay, this is bad. I was actually hoping the the model will lock onto the expo and get one shot. So that that did not work out fine, and he got a really decent value off my princess star there. But no problem. Let's see if we can come back. Hopefully we can do something. Rascals. So okay. I'm gonna increase pressure on the left lane here. That that did not work out fine. But still, we took out the expo pretty okay, pretty slick. So. Miner got some decent shots too, so that that's that was a nice push. I want to increase pressure one more time. So defensive um goblin gang or should I say splitting goblin gang? I want to have a defensive mortar and rascals. Babar too. But first miner, let's let's see if um goblins can assist the miner there. Okay, no, that did not work out successfully. Okay. Goblin gang, goblin gang should get some shot there. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, the the, the, the rascals wasn't even necessary, but still I'm gonna increase pressure here since he already uses fireball onto my rascals there, and the bats went down because of the eyes gloom. I should have seen that coming. I should have seen that coming. So okay, expo one more time. That goblin first. That wasn't the plan, but um okay. Goblin gang he already used. Okay, no sorry, rascals already used this log. Oh yes, fireball. I forgot. Okay, come on, come on. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. Goblin Gang did not go down on time, so I couldn't I couldn't defend against that um, expo push. So it's gonna win by default um, countdown or whatever that is called. Well, GG here, GG is to clash with Mafia. Here. Um, it was a pretty interesting game, honestly. Score sheet one one now. Final game should decide who wins this. So I'm gonna switch up to motor 2.9, but this time I'm gonna remove the ice spirit and replace with the miner. Okay. I have a bad feeling about this because my only win condition is the miner and I don't have a significant tank to take damage for the expo or from the expo. So what I'm gonna try to do is use um rocket. So this first, this first then the rocket. 
You see, this is the problem. I was just going to, I was just going to see if that would happen. The problem now is that as we might get one or two shots or one or two seconds of rapid fire onto my prince star when I choose the rocket because I will have nothing to tank for the speed and the shot, which is really which is really painful by the way. So let's just see what I can do. Let's see if I can turn this over. Minor to the prince's star there, but I cut it with the ice spray doesn't doesn't mean doesn't mean much we got some decent heat there so defensive water to start off so in case it goes with rocket sorry in case it goes with the expo then i can safely use rocket or i just defend so i'm going with prince and archers this time i should get some heat onto the expo there okay fine oh he has log i forgot hopefully motor could do something scaling things just to be safe okay okay that like that good deployment sometimes can ruin the whole game for me and so far, I think this is what is killing my game, the last game and also this game. But let's see if we can sustain or smash. Well, let's let's see. Okay, um, Atchers and the Ice Goblin, Ice um, Ice Golem, but still, um, Knights behind there just to wipe out the Atchers. Let's let's be safe. Let's play safe here. We don't want to give him too much value. So, even though the Ice Golem there got some nice damage or death damage onto my princess star doesn't really mean that much but um little by little it takes my hp and that's not that's not um great to know okay so this time i just tank successfully until the expo went down even after the rocket so yeah that that's okay that's okay but so not too great because recycle cycling back to um rockets it's not that fast because oh wait it's a little bit fast <laughs> yeah yeah I mean, because sometimes you might want to deploy um minor instead of oh yikes yikes now you see you got another shot onto my tower there which is really bad for me i'm going with another defensive mortar but um this one this won't work out fine like i expected i'm going to minor again i want to increase pressure but still knight first and the archers i'm taking this i want to risk okay okay actually i did not expect that test i wanted to risk um using the using the uh ashes first instead of using rocket and that didn't work out fine so now that we take out the expo but that was a little bit too late and another expo is coming here from my opponent this is really toxic by the way if you're watching this video clash off this is a toxic gameplay and i will sue you for this <laughs> okay the the expo was locked onto the motor but that wasn't enough even the ashes wasn't enough and it got locked onto my princess star again so this is gg um you're just gonna cycle rocket sorry cycle fireball so i already lost this game and i already lost this battle of three best murder or best expo gameplay so okay okay guys well gg is to clash them off one more time i already know i've lost even though i'm trying to increase pressure <laughs> just just to be sure or just to be safe sometimes you know the internet cannot be your friend most times so well not today not today for me not today for the mother deck or the mother family i know i'm a bad player i'm a bad mother player but um I, I i made tons of mistakes significantly and that cost me the match also the deck i used for the last round wasn't the best i should have used my my r grader deck uh well gg to clash them off one more time thank you guys for watching this video ordinarily i do not do or go beyond 10 minutes of a uh, video but today it was a spectacular special one so thanks for watching guys sorry for the delay see you guys next time on to my next upload peace out